makes this shit real I contemplate that how I feel But you make it way too hard to think What's up guys, welcome back to my channel My name is Diamond Diva 80s If you new here don't forget to hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down below. So today I will be doing, this is my first time ever trying NYX foundation. As you, I, all the videos that I've been doing my makeup with, it was either, what was the Fit, the Fit Me by Maybelline, I think. And the other one that I got offline, that um, El El Macinage, what whatever the name is, <laughs> but it's so hard to pronounce that that word is ridiculous. But um, it's like my tongue get tied up when I do it. But my face is bare, and where I got this from, they really didn't have a tester, so I could test my um color type out. So we just gonna go with the flow. I did it on my hand and it blended in real good. So yeah. I already had put the primer on my face and this it. So let's get into it. Cause this ain't gonna be a um I should have now need no. I should have cut down my brush. But it'll be alright. So here goes the foundation that I chose. And it's in honey. It's honey. I thought I had another. Mm, probably. So it's supposed to be a 24 hour matte finish foundation. So let's try it out, y'all. I got my mirror down here. So. We're gonna try it out. I should have shook it up first because when I tried it on my hand, it was like real water. Okay, it should be good enough. Oh yeah, because at first when I put it on my hand, it was like real runny. So let's try it out, y'all. It's so cold in the house that the dog on foundation cold. I ain't worrying about doing my makeup. I'm just trying to do a tester, see how do it actually blend in. And if it's a um a finish. Cause to be honest, that um they fit me. I love it. I love it. When it when it blends all the way in, I don't know how well. Maybe have my face so um smooth. Put a little bit more. I be trying this um the concealer is supposed to be good like when you taking pictures and stuff like that so this right here and then I found this right here I had this on um last night and I like it line it up with a um With a um, with a lip liner, you good to go. You are good to go. I'm gonna cut my face or I 
you know I like to go uh, all the way down. I mean, it blended in real good. It blended in real good. So let's see if the uh, the concealer gonna do the same thing. Okay, let's go in with the concealer. Cause I do not like my makeup to look like I am cast it ready. I don't. Y'all, them nails still long, but no problem. Don't wash my hands so many times; it still ain't came up yet. Like it dark. It could look look a uh, um, look dark. I bought this too, y'all, but it's not NYX. This the um, banana powder HD um, baking powder. Yeah, I see it. Yep, I bought that, and this I love it. I love it. Concealer too dark. I really do. There's something I'm gonna have to get used to because uh, um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna go in and try to set my own um, path. I'm just doing it to set it, basically. I don't know how to freaking feel about this foundation because I feel like it's a little bit too dark for my skin. Y'all let me know because I can't really tell and my thing is looking normal. 
like natural looking. I don't know. And I'm doing the powder to see the bottom part. But that concealer. The concealer is not giving. It's like it's too dark or something. I don't know. Yeah, I just wait shit to wear it. I thought they still didn't have nothing on there. Not my part my own. Makeup bag. <sighs> I ain't gonna do no concealer and all that. I'm just, I was just trying to see how it would look, but it's not giving. I don't know if I got the wrong. I don't know if I got the wrong color, but the lady helped me out on find, trying to find it, but oh, I wish she had a head, like, I wish she had a head, um, uh, Like a tesser. It's like it's good to have um a tesser to uh be able to know what color that you you know what shade you need and stuff like that. But this one right here is this a honey, but it had like another honey if I ain't mistaken, but I probably gonna have to do some work with this. I'm probably gonna have to mix it up with something else. Let me put my lip gloss on because I it's it's not giving. I don't know. I don't know if it's because it's so matted, but it's not giving. Ugh. Not like a lip gloss. I, I probably, I'm not going to say I don't like it, but I don't know. It's just not giving me the liking of what I would have thought it would have been. I my thing is, I might have to, um, I might have to uh, mix this in with something else. One of my foundation that I already have. So, okay, y'all see it better? Cause it probably was like too far off. But I don't know. I'm looking over here trying to see because. let me know do you think this foundation and the HD concealer was worth purchasing because the concealer look like it's the it can be the same tone of my um, my skin complexion cuz I was so scared to get hold on that ain't it boy what the Oh, here you go. Okay. Now, here go my... Here go the matte one. 24-hour matte concealer. Right here. Stop trying to get my face camera. Okay, look at this color. 
Now this color is is lighter than it's lighter than my skin complexion. But look at this one. You would think this was more lighter. This would be more lighter than my skin complexion. I'm gonna put both of them to the side. What well, beside each other? You see? So the one, the Mac one, have a more yellow undertone than this one right here. So I don't know, but when I put it on my face, it made it look dark where I can see it or whatever. The, I mean, it blended in real good to my skin. I just ain't did the whole now, y'all. Maybe when I use it again, I'm going to try to do the whole now, y'all, with it. You know, the whole face, the that shadow, the contour, and all that. I would just want to do it without the contour. I put the powder on there just to put the powder on there. But it seemed like I'm going to have to use both concealer. Then put the banana powder on there to set it and do my contour. And I'm going to see if it work out from there. Right now, this just is a, um, this just a review. So, I'm not bashing NY, NYXL. I love their product. I'm just trying to see where I got it from. Why they didn't have no testers. So, that was, that was one red flag when I asked her. Like, what's the price of it? And she's like, I can just scan it for you. Yep. But, anywho, this is all for the video. Like I said, I wasn't trying to make it long. This is how the foundation look on my face. It's blended in and it's matte. Maybe when I, if I had a, went on and put my setting spray on and all that, it probably would have been, you know, more you know enough definition to see but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like share comment and subscribe to my channel make sure you hit the notification bell so you'll be notified for every single video that i post until next time you guys i'll see you in my next video peace out i love you